ladies and gentlemen. Gentlemen and ladies. I, I don't know where we're headed, ladies and gents. White Snake! In my background, ladies and gentlemen. I'm going to turn them down just a little bit because we got to talk. I need all of you to pay attention to what's in front of you. How in the world can these individuals have, now I need y'all to pay attention, an employer identification number. Now don't let them tell you they can have an employer identification number. It ain't no big deal because that's, pay attention to the words. That's a lie. Do not let them say that they can have an employee identification number and it ain't no big deal. That's a lie. Employee identification numbers are given by the IRS for tax purposes. Ladies and gentlemen, here we go again. Okay. White snake. Ladies and gentlemen, how is it possible? for every court in the United States of America to be a corporation, to be run by a corporation. Their judicial counsel, the rules are provided by a corporation, not by the judicial branch of government. There is nothing in any constitution allowing any court to be a corporation. Go ahead, go back and look at the constitution. See if it says anything about any branch of government, whether it be Congress or anybody else, being a corporation. You got an ongoing case? Bring it up. What have you got to lose? What have you got to lose? If you remain silent, then you'll figure out what you got to lose pretty soon. Sooner or later. Ladies and gentlemen, information for you to do whatever you want to do in the description you will find this list gotta go gotta go gotta go gotta go